My name is Hubert Chan. After reviewing this tape, some people might think I'm lying, some might think I'm crazy, some will be upset, while others will consider I'm honest. But the tape has to be made. Google was designed by Larry, Sergey, and me in February 1997. The design includes a search engine algorithm, the business model, what's called AdSense and AdWords, the name of the company, the outline of system architecture, a corporation culture like a grad school, and Google's growing path. Uh, we also discussed other interesting technology ideas that can change the world and make the world a better place. We know that even though Google wouldn't be a complete failure, uh, but to make it successful, we still need help from many people and we still need some luck. We really want to create a place that people will ask fundamental questions. Um, even if we might have those answers to the questions, we will still encourage asking them because others might come up with a better solution. And if they do not, we will gradually lead them to discover the prepared answer we have, just like some teachers will do. Larry and Sergey were introduced to me through Professor Mwani of Stanford University Computer Science Department. Professor Mwani visited NYU in the summer of 1996, and that's how we met. Um, in January 1997, I have a view about uh, treating the web page as a graph and as a mathematical property of this graph to Professor Mwani and how to model traversing the graph and whether it can be used in web search. Professor Mwani says he doesn't know whether it's going to be useful or not. Um, and I got anxious and asked him if he can find someone to help and work with me. And two weeks later, I got an email from Larry and Sergey, and over the email, we became friends. It was an intensive and interesting collaboration. Uh, Larry and Sergey have thought about counting the links on the web page, but they didn't go far. Uh, at one point, Larry asked me what's the formula to try. I gave him one formula with an intuition why it might work and how to use it. Um, essentially, each page has a value. We call it uh, page rank, as in web page. And we think it's fun because it's also rhyme with Larry's last name. As I was preparing for my PhD preliminary exams, so they started constructing the search engine. After a few months, in the earlier September 1997, uh, they asked me whether I want to put my name on the paper that they're going to submit for a conference. Uh, I, after some thought, I decided not to. Uh, it may seem unwise now, but it makes sense then, because I have to finish my PhD, and putting names on the paper is the commitment to finish the Google project. That will not lead to a PhD. Uh, to acquire a PhD is to uh, fulfill my father's wish. When my father was young, he got a full art scholarship from the United States, but he wasn't able to accept it because my grandfather didn't lend him the money for the airline ticket. So as the only child since I was a kid, I was told that I don't have to worry about going aboard and study. And other than that, I owe my life to my father. Uh, when I was 10 years old, I got internal gastric bleeding. Uh, if it's not my father's immediate discovery and rescue, I won't be here today. It, it was an uncomfortable and difficult decision. I told Larry and Sergey that after a few years, assuming I finish my PhD, I will contact them and they can go ahead with the Google project. Larry and Sergey and I all want to change the world and make the world a better place. We also have one other thing in common, that we all have parents who are teachers. They say they understand why I choose what I have to do. In late 2002, I got my PhD, and the initial contact was promising. Then it took a different turn without any warning or given any explanation. Then it was off and on and finally stopped. 
the responses were always from the third person and not directly from Larry or Sergey. Unfortunately, my email contact uh, communication with them in 1997 was not safe. Uh, my email quota was small at the time and um, it often exceeds the quota, so I didn't save them. Since last contact, I have been agonizing and whether or not to talk about it. Probably, Larry and Sergey were busy. Um, they didn't communicate with the employee well, or their employee didn't communicate with them well, or they, do, they were undecisive about how to place or position me, or they are in a status that is awkward to fully acknowledge the past. I do not know which. It's been 10 years. I think this information needs to be known.